Today is Thursday, March 17, 2022. I've been long the S&P 500 since two days ago on Tuesday, since Tuesday. And today I sold half of my position, um, two transactions. These are my current position, 14 shares. Uh, if we go to history, you can look at the transactions, the top two transactions. Uh, I sold seven, and then I sold another seven. Those are the prices, uh, date, and time are there also. If we go to the charts, this is the daily chart. One of the reasons why I decided to book some profits, it has gone up too much too fast. Uh, look at the size of that move, up more than 200 points in three days, up three days in a row. Time to book some profits. Uh, if tomorrow gaps up, say around the 50 day moving average, that's the purple line, where you see the red highlighted in red, around 44.30, I would sell the rest of my position probably, or at least another quarter. If we uh, go lower, I will consider liquidating my position. If it dips below 43, the, food, the first green uh, zone around 43.30, which was today's low. Uh, let's look at the five minute chart so you can look at the transactions uh, for today. Let me uh, to your left. That was the open. Open a little bit lower. And then around 1030, that's when I sold first quarter of my position where you see the blue arrow. That was the first quarter of my position, and then I liquidated the other quarter of my position at around 2, I think it was what, like 2.10 p.m., where you see the other arrow here, the blue arrow. It was a very strong day, finished at the high of the day, so which implies that tomorrow could go even higher, but of course... We've gone up so much that don't be surprised if we end up uh, opening lower. So anyways, those are my two transactions for today. Going back to my uh, account, P&L wise, I'm up $378 year to date. Started my account with $2,000. So that's roughly... 18% year to day, which is very good compared to the S&P 500, which is down still, I think, 8% for the year. And my goal is to beat it by 26%, Delta 6%. So I'm doing very well.